Hello, Texoma. I'm KFDX TV3 meteorologist Brian Rupp with a check of your forecast on this Wednesday, May 27, 2015. We're going to begin by recapping what happened yesterday on the 26th. Here are the details. We had a high temperature of 82, morning low of 55, the average is 86 and 63, record high 102 back in 1990, record low 51 back in 1946. We received 38 hundredths of an inch of rain at Wichita Falls Regional Airport. That takes us for the month. The wettest month ever in the history of Wichita Falls since 1897 at 14.53 inches. That compares to normal at 3.08. We have received 22.64 for the year 2015. Normal is 1078, so we are more than 11 inches above where we should be for this time in the month and this time in the year. In fact, for the year, we're closing in in 12 inches above normal. Let's take a look at the storm reports received for the day yesterday. We can see the green circles on your screen indicating hail reports. We're looking at quarter size hail 10 miles east of Lawton. We've got golf ball size hail near Empire City, Oklahoma. That was reported at 659 last night. Golf ball size hail near Hastings, Oklahoma reported 632 p.m. Golf ball size hail 6 miles southwest of Hastings. Then we get near Charlie and we find ping pong ball size hail. We head down to the south. Golf ball size hail, two miles north of Jolly. Get into uh, nine miles east of Holiday. Ping pong ball size hail, one mile west of Shepherd Air Force Base. I live near there. Quarter size hail, and I can confirm we had quarter size hail. Heading down to the south, ping pong ball size hail near Winthorst, Texas at 4.55 p.m. Uh, also near Winthorst, Texas at 4.35, quarter size hail, and a report near Olney of Hanegg size hail. That's getting very large. And the tornadoes were located down to the south in Palo Pinto County outside of the Texoma viewing area. So it was a very active day with most of the reports being large hail. And it looks like we could see a repeat performance of severe weather coming up this afternoon with the main uh, threats going to be large hail and damaging thunderstorm wind gusts. Let me give you the latest information on the Wichita River as of 9.39 this morning. Flood stage is 18 feet. Current stage is 19.6 feet. The river is beginning to fall a little faster than it was over the past couple of days. The river forecasts to fall below flood stage on Thursday morning. So we have less than 24 hours to go before the flood comes to an end. Futurecast in motion looks at a 60% chance of showers and thunderstorms between 1 p.m. and 1 a.m. for tonight into tomorrow morning. And then another opportunity of showers and thunderstorms coming up for the day tomorrow as we get into your Thursday and also into your Friday. So we will be monitoring that. Otherwise, the storm outlook for today between 1 p.m. and 1 a.m., a slight risk of severe weather across all of Texoma. The individual elements that we are looking at, a moderate risk of a large hail, a moderate risk of high winds. The tornado threat is very low. In fact, it is near zero at this time. That could change between now and later on this afternoon, but right now the tornado threat is near zero. The flooding threat is going to remain very high for the day today. And in fact, all the way through Saturday, the flash flooding threat is going to remain high. Wind forecast over the next couple of days, we're looking winds generally out of the southerly flow, out of the southeast, south, or southwest. You can see that continuing as we go into Thursday and eventually into Friday. High temperatures later on this afternoon are going to be into the 70s in our northeast counties, 80s elsewhere across Texoma. In fact, the upper 80s to near 90 degrees in our southwest counties, especially out towards Caudill, King, and Knox County. Here's forecast in detail. Partly cloudy skies, AM thunder showers are possible. Not too many of them, but a couple could pop up. We already had a couple this morning that did go strong as they made their way through Tillman, Cotton, Comanche, Jefferson, and Steve counties. Those have now ended, but we could see a couple more pop up later on this afternoon after 1 o'clock. Afternoon strong thunderstorms possible, 60% chance, 84 the high temperature, south-southeast wind of 10 to 20, sunset coming up at 837. Forecast for this evening and overnight, 64 the overnight low. Evening heavy thunderstorms are possible, a 60% chance. Then mostly cloudy, southeast wind of 5 to 15. Sunrise coming up at 626 tomorrow morning. The extended forecast, the Norman National Weather Service office is monitoring the situation, looking at the possibility of additional heavy rain tonight, 
Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, 60% chance of showers and thunderstorms across the board now through Saturday. Then the opportunity for storms will dwindle down as we get into the month of June. High temperatures will be in the 70s and 80s, overnight lows into the 50s and the 60s. From KFDX TV3, Texoma's Weather Authority, I'm meteorologist Brian Rupp, and that's a check of your forecast on Wednesday.